Hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to beat Pokemon Red and Green in a very, uh, short amount of time. Now, Pokemon Red and Green were only released in Japan, and they were the earliest versions of Pokemon in, that were ever released, and this, is, this glitch is the only version that it works on, so you have to do it in the Japanese Pokemon Red or the Japanese Pokemon Green. So, the glitch doesn't really start until after we get our first Pokemon, but I just, but it takes some explaining to do, and so I'm just, uh, leaving all this in here. What you want to do first, after you set up your rival and yourself, is you want to get that potion. I guess for this glitch to work, you need two items in your pack. Now just go through the game like you would in an English version and get your Pokemon. I'm going through it very fast like a speedrunner would. I don't get any special time, but it's, you know, it's fun to do. And like I said, the glitch doesn't start until, the af until after we get our Pokemon. And the Pokemon doesn't really matter. I just choose Charmander because it's the easiest for the rival battle. Because that, because that makes your rival choose Squirtle, which doesn't know Growl, and that means that he can't slow you down with attack with attack lowering moves. So I just get into the rival battle, and everything goes normal. So I won the battle, our rival leaves the room, nothing special. Now what we have to do is we just have to go through the game to Viridian City. And there we have to go into the Pokemart and get, and get Oak's parcel like we usually would. Fortunately for this recording I never got any, any encounters on this route. That only happened to me once before when I was trying to do this. Like I said, just go into this Pokemart, get Oak's parcel, and then head back. And the glitch doesn't start until you almost get back to Peloton. Preferably in the last in the last stretch of grass, right before you get back. You can set up this glitch before you get into the battle, but I I found that it's quicker once you do it in battle. But for the sake, but for the sake of explaining things, it makes it a lot harder. So I have to go quick. You want to get into an encounter, and then go into your pack. Once you're in your pack, you want to go down to your second item in your in your pack. Select it so you can switch it and exit your pack. Like I'm doing here, go into your Pokemon, press A so it does that glitchy thing. Go into your attacks and then run. It's pretty quick, but if you can do that, you're good. Now just follow my exact path that I'm doing right here. Obviously you can see Oak, so that means that something's definitely up. Once you've done this, just go into that door, then go behind this house, around this old man, through these trees, up, past this building and into the next door. That'll cause this glitchy town thing, and then you'll get some text. And eventually once that's over, the screen goes white, and congratulations, Hall of Fam. And that is how you beat Pokemon Green in like five minutes. 